So as we think about a path to multiplication, one of the key ways to multiply is to be able to entrust ministries, responsibilities to other people. So it can't just be a one leader, many follower model, but you saw Jesus investing in a few, knowing that those 12, those 72, those 120, someday would most likely be leading their own ministries, having their own teams under them, having their own churches uh, around them. And so as we look at multiplication, we realize that we need to restructure so that we're giving, we're opening up more avenues for service and for loving the lost, and also that we're entrusting the ministry to many leaders, not just to one or two. And then also along the way, Jesus is always there through the power of the Holy Spirit to support us and to continue training and teaching us. And that's also a key is that as we think about multiplication, we still continue to support and train the leaders around us. And um, by the grace of God, just like in that first church, just like in the first century of of the church in the book of Acts, we see in one generation the gospel going out to the whole civilized world. And that was just one generation. So imagine what we can do as we continue to multiply across the entire world.